Now, normally on Fridays, we have B.B. Shea come in and do what we call the weekly wrap-up, R-A-P. So he comes in and he does in rap form every topic we've talked about this whole week. But we're taking a three-day weekend. Dave's headed east. I'm headed west. Does this mean, uh, yep. B.B. Shea, that today's wrap-up will be 20% shorter? No, it actually may be a little bit longer. Oh, wow. Oh, dear God. Yeah. A little longer. A little even. longer than normal, yeah. Well, that's right. So yeah. huh. uh, that's – and Biggie will stay here because he had his week off when he was in the hospital. Yep. Lucky. So he doesn't get any more. <laughs> you got to lay and pee into a tube for a week. I told him. <laughs> I don't, I don't get that luxury. I hope you had fun because you're not getting any more days mm-hmm. off. You know, we just went ahead and told him that. Some spring break. Now <laughs> – he peed into a tube for eight days, and I said, enjoy it. He's not the first spring breaker to do it. Right? Well, He's that's not right. going to be the last. That's right. You know, B.B. Shea and I were just chatting. Uh, we were talking about golf. You're golfing this weekend. Oh, yeah, definitely. And we share something. You said you don't like to drink when you golf because you like to be in control of it. Absolutely. As do I. Yeah. I refuse. In case the tour calls. <laughs> you never I, know. I want to be sharp. In case, in case the Saudis call you. <laughs> I want to be sharp. Keep yeah. a bag packed in the back of your trunk yeah. just in, in case. In, listen, in any of my athletic endeavors, some of these guys, we're out pickleballing, and especially in the summer, between games, like, let's have a boo, a brew. And I was like, oh, no. no Keep no, it no. away. No, I don't. I want to stay sharp. Razor sharp. Can you imagine my dinking if I was somehow – half buzzed we're not going to do that that's not happening anyhow i was glad to hear you say that yeah also i came to your defense earlier there was an email yesterday from a guy named scotty we call him not hottie scotty and the only line was does bb in bb shea stand for buffalo butt or balloon belly <laughs> mm. And what? yes, that's right. Yeah, that's we, it. We said it's so, over the line. Over the line! <laughs> and that's your movie. That's your movie. Perfect. And I said to Chris, I said, let him let him come up in here and say it to my face. You he know? did as, as, as close as he could get to the building, by the way. I mean, read in your email. Can you believe That's right. Yeah. Emailed it right to me. And you think I'm not going to defend this guy right here? I mean, a- apropos of nothing, he just comes in and says, does it stand for buffalo butt or balloon belly? And you don't know this guy, do you? Is no. it Scotty? Scotty. Mm-hmm. What? Yeah. And just, uh, and Chris said, over the line. Over the line! Exactly what it is. We may have a, uh, what do they call it in the rap world? Beef? <laughs> there might be some beef. Yeah. There's some stars. Talk, some I mean, beef. talk yeah, about, yeah. I think it's just jealousy or being insecure. I don't even know why. Why would you say that? Both of Out of nowhere, just to say Make that. Make themselves feel better about themselves. Yeah. For, you know, and I said, Break, come on up in here. Yeah. <laughs> And say it to my face. He did. Okay, so he I did. S- say it to my face. But you know, we'll when, see what happens. When people do show up, you run. Well, I'm yeah. taking a three-day weekend. <laughs> <laughs> I won't be here show up tomorrow. Yeah. I will not be here tomorrow. <laughs> just in case. Come uh, on Scotty. in here tomorrow. Yeah. Let's see what happens. <laughs> yeah. All right. Let's just see what happens. That's right. So I'm sorry to be the one to bring yeah. you that. It's a little BB. disrespectful. I'm not going to lie. Well, it's mm-hmm. totally hurts, I'm sure. 100% yeah. disrespectful. Not to mention... Buffalo butt hasn't been used since the late 70s. <laughs> it was funny then. <laughs> funny on good times. It was times. fun. Way back when, when uh, Bookman, the uh, custodial engineer, was called Buffalo Butt by Wilona on that show. <laughs> we right. all remember. The right. classic good yeah. time. We know it. You may not know <laughs> yeah. it. Are you? I, I hate to hit you cr- being between the eyes with that one but and get you into a rap. Are you ready for it? Well, though? it's got to be done, man, so let's do it. It's got to be done. <clears throat> Does it let's, need a setup? Uh, we got a beat, man, and that's about okay. it. So all you need is a beat. Yeah. Let's start the beat and get the weekly wrap up a day early. Attention everyone, don't change your demeanor. We are in the presence of an active senior. Dem said it first, man, so don't harm me. He would know. He read it in AARP. It might hurt Kelly, but this is really you. You're already eating the foods you can't chew. This week it's $12 salads and bone broth. Next week it's porridge and peas, extra soft. I heard about your lunch with the friend the other morning. According to him and Dave, you were really, really boring. This is no shock, but I'm not a psychologist. You must be pretty boring to bore a meteorologist no offense dave you're my fave and it's evident let's hear some more jokes about the 15th president dave's thing game has really got me pissed james buchanan references just weren't on my list man man weather dave the fashion icon i thought you wore some shoes at a python but you just wore shorts and i really don't get it biggie wears shorts every day but he gets no credit dave wears shorts and everyone goes crazy biggie does the same thing and people call him lazy what a dichotomy 
me It really is sad Like when Kelly's phone goes off And no one gets mad Biggie can't win He's disrespected like a hobby Does he drink skim milk? Okay, you got me And not <laughs> I'm sorry, man. Can you please cut the beat, Kelly? What? Sure, yeah. Cut the beat, please. Okay, yeah. What? All right. What's going on? This Scotty dude's got me heated. Uh, oh no, I'm this sorry. Scotty dude's that. got me. Do you need a moment? I can, I can imagine. You yeah. know what? No, yeah. no, no. Let's, let's let me handle this like a pro. All right, All right yeah. All right, listen. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. <clears throat> I gotta take a sec to discuss this dude, Scotty. He called me out, so let me spit the facts like Rodney. He tried to hurt my feelings, but I know that he can't, pretending who he's not, a fake G like John ja Moran. Kelly read the email, I know that he was tripping. Stay in your lane, I'll be like Mike, you be pippin'. Scotty, BB stands for big body, and this big body is really gonna body Scotty. Mm. Scotty, time to pay the piper like Roddy, flushing all those crappy <laughs> jokes right down the potty. He tried to guess the meaning, but it's just not the same. BB stands for buffalo butt. That must be your mom's name You could have reached out And we could have teamed up I bet y'all weren't expecting To see Scotty get beamed up A mean mug I don't think you understand fully At this point BB stands for big bully At this point If the hating don't stop It's Oscars 22 I'm Will Smith You're Chris Rock I love you Scotty But you know this ain't a game It's all love man Just put some respect on my name Right there. Stop the fight. That's awesome. I never seen I never seen anything like that. <laughs>